Hello everyone, Razmataz87 here from Game Timers. Welcome back to another episode of City Skylines. As you know from the last one, we were continuously, and it will be a forever problem, working on traffic. Uh, we're still working on traffic. We're still trying to get it fixed. As you can see, there's traffic everywhere. Everywhere in the city. Traffic, traffic, traffic. And if you ever played City Skylines, that's going to be something that you'll always be fighting is traffic. Trying to find new ways to try to help alleviate traffic everywhere. Um, left y'all on a little bit of a cliffhanger last episode. Um, we're going to do something about this right here. Uh, I'm going to get a very simple road. Just going to go with this one it looks like. And I'm going to grab right here. And connect right there. Very simple road. One in, one out. And I'm going to destroy that. And then I'm going to grab the simple road again. Let's turn all this off. Let's anarchy this joker in here. Bam. <clears throat> and honestly, I, I can see already that this is, this is probably going to be a problem, but let's find out. First thing I got to do is move this sucker. We're going to move him right there. Uh, yeah, I think that would be all right for right now. Let, let's let's find out. Let's see what happens here. Obviously, a lot of trucks are going to disappear. Wait, we got roads not attached here. Let's try this again. There we go. Alright, so let's see what happens here. Maybe this will help out a little bit with this traffic. Get them somewhere else. It's going to take them a little while to clear out of here, of course. Yeah, see, the way I'm looking at it is there's not hardly any trucks going in this little section right here because I've banned trucks from going in here. So they should be able to flow really nicely out of there. Yeah, as you can tell already, it's starting to clear out already. Very nice. Y'all know what I'm going to do. I should have already known. <laughs> Let's just keep the traffic flowing here. And look, this is completely empty now. So now, realistically, what we can do is, like, these guys, we know this area is not going to be anywhere as busy as it was. So get some of these off this main road, and it will free it up a little bit. I don't think that's going to fit. Actually, what we can do is just pop him right there. Let's see if he can fit. Yeah, there we go. So now that all that's off the main road, and it'll free everything up a little bit. There we go. All right. So that's the main thing. In, in this area, I was actually considering t taking this completely out and redesigning it. But the main thing about industry areas that you got to be wary of is keep everything off the main roads. Do not let your, your, your vehicles stay on those main roads. 
all right everything all the flow is looking good still backed up here of course but it's getting it's actually gotten down a ton yeah lot, lots of traffic moving in here that's good we're getting some backup right here of course what kind of road is this this is a two lane let's actually upgrade this this is very busy Let's get that upgraded. Maybe we get some better traffic flow through there. As usual, we got buildings on fire. But yeah, all right. So we're just now still focused on this area. Let's take a look. While we're looking around, obviously, I want to remind you guys, if you if you don't mind, make sure you uh, smash that like button, comment down below, subscribe, all that fun stuff if you want to see more content from me or Derek. Uh, we greatly appreciate it. Uh, me and um, Max are trying our best to bring you some content. Um, if you have any questions at all, if uh, comments, anything like that, make sure you... Uh, put it in the comments down below. We try to read all of them. If we don't get to yours, we will eventually, so we apologize. I also want to let you guys know that I am starting up a second channel that's just going to be me. Um, and it's going to be designed around comic books and collectibles. I have a very addictive personality, and because of that, whenever I start buying stuff, I like to buy a lot of stuff. And then I also like to read comic books, and I have a pretty large comic book collection definitely not the biggest in the world but it's, it's, it's pretty significant and uh, you know I like to share uh, all the stuff I've been reading so if that's something that's interesting to you uh, I will have the description down below and uh, you can follow me on that channel also all right let's take a look at the traffic area is a little busier a little busier this is super this will always be super busy there's just there's nothing I can do about it really I made like a quasi roundabout here. Um, you know what I need to do to get this working a little better. First and foremost, I need to get this off this roundabout. Let's see how we can do this. Scoot you down a little bit. And then I'm going to grab you, place you there. Get that off the roundabout. Place you over here. Place you somewhere else too. Right there is fine. And where can I place you? Doesn't look like I can. Aha. Place you there. And then what we're going to do is I'm going to upgrade these roads. I'm not going to do nothing crazy. We'll just do the two, two highway. Oh, got an auto save happening. There we go. And I'm also going to downgrade this road. This guy. So I feel like that is just way too big. There we go. Now let's see if we can make this more roundabouty. Ooh, sharp corner there though. Yeah, that's the only thing that sucks about that. Let, let's not do that. Um, hmm. <laughs> Let's rethink this area a little bit to try to help these guys out.
pop that right there. And, uh, I'll grab this road. Connect right up. Oh, I grabbed the wrong road. That's okay. Do that. And then we'll grab right here. And the reason why I'm doing all this is because we are going to make this area a little, little bit more efficient. Grab you. Get you out of the way. Get you out of the way. Get you out of the way. All right. This is probably a terrible idea. But we're going to see what we can do to make this a little bit better. Uh, yeah, that, that that's fine. We're going to go in here. Grab our basic road. And you know what I'm placing in here. A legit roundabout. <laughs> Make a pretty big one. Bam. Uh-oh. How am I going to get this piece out of here? Hmm. What? See, it's like little things like this aggravate me about this game. Like, why is that not connecting? That makes no sense. Why it won't let me do that? I, I know it's not perfectly straight, but that's okay. We're going to have to anarchy. I don't know why it's not letting me do that. This game. Love it to death. And of course, since I anarchied it, it won't let me place anything there. What in the world is going on here? Anarchy's off. No, there's nothing going on here. Oh, so apparently if you don't have node snapping on, it won't let you do it the proper way. Well, let's go down just a little bit. Yeah, all right. Well, I'm definitely not going to have this connected right there, though. All right, and then what I'm going to do over here is I'm going to actually put highway back in. Oh, we got to move a couple pumps. It 
efficiency. Trying to do the best I got. Just put in some highway here. And then of course. Oh gosh. No, why? Why would you do this? I have literally built hundreds of roundabouts and none have done this in a long time. But of course the minute Yep, and the nodes are jacked up now. The minute I decide to tr uh, do it again without building the supports it's like no, you you, you can't do that. All right. And I don't know how well this is going to work. We're, we're just going, we're trying it out. And then we need to flip that road. <clears throat> All right. And then we need, I just want to grab just a plain old industrial road. Uh, let's go forward just a little bit, but then we're going to have to, we're going to curve around. <laughs> oh, this game. Why must you give me ugly roundabouts? All right. See, the only thing I'm not a crazy fan of is they're going to have to cross right here, which may cause some problems. But we'll see. <clears throat> we'll see if that helps with just general traffic flow over here. That actually helps a lot. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, it's just getting lame. Oh, what the heck? Okay, we're back. Uh, see, I don't like how they're crossing over each other, though. It's, it's like not smooth. We'll let it run for a little bit, and I'll, I'll come back to it. Because don't know if that's the most efficient way, but oh my gosh, and they're getting they're getting butchered over here pretty bad. Well, the traffic's gone down for sure. It's just, there's, I think there's just so many people trying to come into this area. Let's see how the traffic is over here. Uh, of what is going on with the, <laughs> that's so weird. It looks like we're fine over here so far. A little industrial traffic, of course, but looks like everything's good. Let's actually check out our... Uh, this guy. 
buses look good. Uh, need to work on the amounts, it looks like. Those look good. Holy mackerel. Where's that yellow line at? Oh, well, there's that many people waiting, and they're not all full. So, even though there's a lot of people on it, six trams seems to be a good number. Or monorail cars, I guess you could call it. And, yay, we're making a profit again. <laughs> Um, we're having, man, these, these daggum death waves and you can see everything else is looking good. Um, the resources, what? Hold on. Who is complaining about resources? These guys. Is there no resources over here? Ooh. Well, that is a bummer. There's really nowhere else for them over here. So I tell you what, I don't want to. Wait, this is a factory, isn't it? Yeah, that's flour mill. Uh, I'll tell you what, we will, um, grain silo. We need to put a warehouse over here for, for flour for these guys, or for, um, uh, uh, yeah, flour. What am I talking about? Don't want a huge one, just a little, just a little one. Wait, flour. No, we need crops. What am I talking about? Well, it doesn't look like it lets you. We'll put flour in there. And we'll actually put the bakery over here. <clears throat> and this needs flour, crops, and animal products. So we will... We need to get some more animal products, so that's the only problem. I think we're going to have to take out a couple of these and put some animal products over here. We'll grab another medium warehouse. Change this to animal products. And... Let's actually take out a couple of these guys because we need animal products. A slaughterhouse will turn crops into animal products? How does that make any sense? Oh, that is big. Where can we finagle this in here? It'll actually fit right there. But we're going to lose some greenhouses. So we'll just move these greenhouses. Ooh, that's a large one. So I'm actually going to destroy that greenhouse and then we will grab the slaughterhouse 
I know you don't like the curvature. But we're going to make you like it. That's probably a mistake putting it on a... Uh, you know what? Hold on. That that's that's a big mistake. Let's not do that. I will grab me a road. And you know what? This uh old old folks home. We gotta find a new home for that. There we go. And what we're going to do here is I'm going to grab me my little road here. Hopefully there's enough room in here for that slaughterhouse because it... Oh no, it's so big. Dang it. But if I take out that road, yeah, that'll work. Take this road out. Do that. And what is this? That's a fire station. I can go right there. There we go. That will work. That way we got our slaughterhouse now. Cool. And then what I was wanting to do over here is I was wanting to grab that. Grab. Well, that's way too big. There's a medium. No, I don't want a fruit field. Medium crop field. Put that there. Yep, and bam. Very nice. That'll work. The only issue with this slaughterhouse, one thing I do not like, is I like to have, and this is why I was considering literally ripping this entire thing up and restarting it, because I don't like having a major factory like a slaughterhouse right there without it having the products it needs, like literally right beside it. So, but, you know. We're going to have to do what we got to do. And then this, have I unlocked the next? I don't think I have. I've got to get these squares bolt so I can fix this. This is, this is madness over here. It's just, it's like a never ending thing. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. I know all, all I'm doing now is working on, um, uh, traffic issues here lately I really think because this is five stars I'm really thinking that we're probably going to rip this out and I'm probably going to remove this ranch in general because it's so it gives us such bad traffic and just put in some office buildings and stuff here maybe some houses that would be kind of cool one of the two this will be either office buildings or houses and just remove that completely because we really don't need that and uh we're gonna we're gonna redesign this somehow. We're probably gonna leave most of the roads intact and just kinda fix how they how they run. Anyways, I hope y'all enjoyed this episode. Uh don't forget about my other channel. A link will be in the description down below. Uh, Raz's comics and collectibles if you're interested at all like I said it's going to be a channel based around uh, I'm going to be doing weekly reviews of new comic books coming out things that I like trying some new things out I'm also going to be showing you collectibles like I have a wall of Funko Pops behind me and action figures and different things like that I'm going to show you all all that fun stuff and then um, showing you know moving on to the next thing because I'm debating on getting into the statue game so if you're wanting to see some cool statues, obviously we're going to move into that a little bit. Um, but other than that, obviously make sure you keep watching the uh, game timers. We're having a lot of fun doing this. We haven't given up. We plan on keep on keeping on with this. I'm having some major fun playing this. I know Max is having a lot of fun playing the games he plays. He's been playing a lot of uh, Plants vs. Zombies here lately. Um, but if you have any suggestions for us, any comments, 
uh, even complaints, uh, make sure you leave them in the comments down below. Smash that like button and don't forget to subscribe. But I hope y'all have a great day. Peace.